What's up everyone, I am Ahmed Khalifa and today I am going to be doing a 3 minute review of a free cool research tool called Google Correlate and it's a very little known place that you can actually get some data out of it. I'm going to be honest, it's not the best tool in the world because it's slightly, you know, kind of slightly cumbersome is the word I'm looking for. I don't know why I thought of that word. Anyway, it's slightly kind of flawed in the way the design is dated. However, if you dig deep, you could get very, very useful keyword research idea right there. So you can type in your ideas straight away there as well. But I just thought of maybe picking any of the queries down below because they seem to be relevant apparently at this time. So let's just say for example, I'm going to click on losing weight. When you do that, you're going to get data that correlates with real time data and it is US focused, you know, that's what I should point out. It's only focused in the US market. And you can see here's a weekly time series and you can look at it in a monthly time series as well against another keyword. So it's almost like Google Trends that I can, you know, I've shown in another video that you can kind of compare which is trending more and this is where you can get very, very specific. And it's not just this keyword, but you can compare it against loads of other keywords as well, which is quite interesting. And the other thing as well, if you are based in the US and you want to focus on the US data, you can compare it with different states in the US market as well. And that's kind of useful actually. So for example, losing weight, you know, you can look at where is it kind of really trending highly in a specific country. So in this case, it looks like the most places, it looks like it's West Virginia in this case for losing weight. The weird thing is as well, when you type in a keyword and you go to the compare US state, you get like quite random related, I say related query in there. And when I click on show more, you can see it's quite random, some relevant if you put losing weight, back pain and stuff like that. But I'm not sure why they mention, you know, losses or and no, for example, that has no relevance. So. It's a hit and miss this tool and maybe the fact that it looks so old it's not really maintained that much but if you are heavily focused in the US market and you want to get data out of it it could be a very useful tool provided that you have the patience to use it to learn it and also once you have that data you take it elsewhere to kind of get the search volume and trends and competition in cost per clip. So it's a funny one I wouldn't say it's the best one out there but it might be useful for some and I guess so I'll do a review of it as well. So hopefully you find this review useful and uh, I have put a list of other reviews on other free keyword research tool that are to be honest better than Google Correlate and uh, I'll put it in the description down below and also link up above and uh, you can you know, look at more options there as well. And I hope you found this video useful anyway even if it's a rubbish to Google Correlate. I hope you found it useful and if you have I would really appreciate it if you can hit the subscribe button down below as well. So in the meantime you just keep on doing your thing. It really does matter and I'll see you next time.